Today I'm going to show you two different ways on how to get your Windows 8 computer into safe mode with networking. So we're going to go ahead and do the first method right now. First you'll just come over here and click on the Windows icon. Hit the search button. Type in the following, msconfig. Right click. Run as administrator. Go to the boot tab and then select safe mode and networking. And what this does is it will, when you reboot the computer, it will put the computer automatically into safe mode and you'll still have networking capabilities, meaning you'll still be able to get onto the internet. Um, once you hit apply and OK, all you'll do is restart. And again, the computer will automatically restart into safe mode with networking. So that's, that's method one. For method two, or option number two, um, if you'd rather, you can come over here and select the Windows icon, click on the power options, hold down the shift button, and click on restart while holding the shift button down. Then select Troubleshoot once the option becomes available. And then select Advanced Options. And then from here, what we want to do is start up Settings. And then we'll go ahead and click Restart. Once the computer is finished uh, restarting or rebooting, it's going to give you a list of options. Now we want Safe Mode with Networking, which is number 5. Now. If you look up at the top in smaller print, it says use the F1 to F9 keys. And so don't hit the number 5. You need to hit F5 in order to enable this option. Once the computer is finished rebooting or restarting, uh, your screen will look something like this. Your wallpaper will most likely be disabled. It will say safe mode in the corners. This little window will just pop up giving you a rundown of what safe mode is. Um, from here you'll be able to do whatever you need to do uh, in safe mode. Once you are finished with doing whatever it is you need to do in safe mode, uh, in order to get out of safe mode, if you did method 2, you can just restart the computer. If you did method 1, what you'll need to do is click the Windows icon Go back to search, type in msconfig, again you will right click, run as administrator, we'll go to the boot options, and we're just going to uncheck that box, hit apply, and OK. And then we'll go ahead and restart, and it will restart the computer back into uh, normal mode.